Hi everyone, welcome back to Job. I'm Shabana and today we will discuss about our job opportunity from Wipro. So before moving further with the video details, I would like to request you to subscribe to Job Curve for more job updates in future. If you are new to the channel, then we are Job Curve and here you will get videos on daily basis for different job recruitment and placement preparation. So consider subscribing to the channel as this will definitely gonna help you get your first job. And with that note, let's quickly move further with the details. So, Wipro is hiring for graduate engineer trainee and uh, we will discuss all the details about this. So, first, uh, let's uh, discuss the job responsibilities uh, for the software engineer uh, trainee. So, uh, you will uh, develop software solutions by studying information needs, studying systems, flow, data, uses and work processes. After that, uh, investigating problem areas followed by the software development life cycle and facilitate root cause analysis of the system issues and problem statement uh, identify ideas to improve system performance and uh, impact availability and uh, analyze client requirements and convert requirement to uh, feasible designs then collaborate with functional team or system analysis uh, who carry your uh, detailed uh, investigation into software requirement and uh, conferring with project managers to obtain information software uh, on software capabilities okay now for the perform code and ensure optimal software module uh, development, uh, you will determine operational feasibility by evaluating analysis, problem definition requirements and software development and uh, uh, proposed software. Okay, You will develop and automate processes for software validation by setting up and designing test cases, scenarios uses cases and uh, executing the test cases and uh, modifying software to fix the errors adapt it to new hardware improve its performance or upgrade interfaces and analyzing information to recommend and plan the installation of new systems or modification of an exciting system then ensuring that the code error free or has no bugs and test failure and ensure all the codes are raised as per the norms defined for the project or program then compile a timely and comprehensive and accurate documentation and reports as requested and coordinating with the uh, team on daily project status and uh, uh, progressed uh, documenting uh, documenting okay now uh, yeah there are some other uh, responsibilities also which comes capturing all the requirements and clarification for for the client for better quality work and taking feedback on the regular basis to ensure smooth and on time delivery and participating in continuing education and training to uh, reimburse uh, re remain current on based best practices learn new programming languages and uh, better assist other team members then consulting with engineering staff to evaluate software uh, hardware interface and develop specifications and perform requirements and uh, document and demonstrate solutions by developing documentation documenting uh, very necessary details and ensure good quality of the uh, interaction with customer and timely response to the customer's request and uh, no instances of complaints either internally or externally okay so these are the job responsibilities for the uh, graduate engineer trainee at Bipro uh, apart from that they have uh, not mentioned any uh, eligibility criteria I think uh, 
yeah there is no eligibility criteria given only there are some uh, behavioral competencies which which you should have so you should have formulation and prioritization innovation managing complexity execution excellence and passion for result okay so these are the some basic competencies uh, which they want in the candidate now uh, as there are no eligibility criteria so any graduate can apply for this uh, job as this job is for graduate engineer training uh, the uh, responsibilities are already given by the company and uh, uh, yeah any graduate can apply and this is related to uh, engineering and this is related to it so you should uh, know one programming language and all the other uh, details they have mentioned okay so apply accordingly if you uh, know all the things they have mentioned then you can definitely apply any batch is eligible so any graduate from any batch can apply i will provide the link in the description box so go and apply as soon as possible and uh, yeah this is all about today's job update i hope you like the video and if you do so then please hit the like button and subscribe to job curve for more job updates in future and uh, i'll be coming back with more such kind of videos till then take care and bye bye